got to think is an understatement. Well, here comes Mark Jindrak, and we heard what the boss told Jindrak earlier, that he had something in store for him tonight, and I guess we're going to find out what that is. Ric Flair turning the tables on the commissioner, Mike Sanders. We've seen where the thrillers have the advantage. They have the edge, not knowing which members are going to be in the ring in a certain match or a tag team match. Well, Flair said he's going to turn it around on the thrillers and Jindrak. But who is he facing? Oh! Uh-oh. Oh. It's Goldberg! Oh. Log on to WCWgear.com to get your Goldberg jersey. And I'm sure that's where Jindrak would rather be right now. Logging on somewhere than to be in the ring against Goldberg. I think I just see Jindrak get down on his hands and knees <laughs> and start praying, God. Well, in my imagination, if he just do that. I just, we took. Or was he trying to do something else? <laughs> took a good look at his face right there. And you may be right, as I stand here at the Mid-South Coliseum, to welcome in one of the true greats in all of sports entertainment, a man whose record is now at 33 and 0, and 176 seems a long way away. But for Goldberg, as the old cliche goes, you line him up and I'll knock him down. No one has been able to derail this monster. Every match is of the utmost importance because not only is the streak on the line, but also the career of Goldberg. Mark Zindrak tonight, if successful, and Sid Goldberg in a tag team match with his teacher, the Sarge, against the newly formed team of the total package, Lex Luger and Buck Bagwell. The fact is, and we heard Flair reinforce it earlier, even in the tag match, the streak is on the line. Some people think that maybe going in with Sarge as his partner Ow. would be a detriment, but Goldberg does not think so. And many of us behind the scenes know that's not the case. Sarge may have spent his time training men to be superstars, but he has performed day in, day out in the ropes, between the ropes. He is one of the toughest men, pound for pound, and a man that Goldberg certainly trusts. Luger and Bagwell cannot afford oh, to be oh overconfident at sin. Goldberg just took Shindrak and tossed the 6'5", 265 pound Shindrak to the floor, comes back up, springboard, caught him in midair. Jindrak, That's amazing. Oh, man. Incredible that he will take a man that size in manhandling. He's Jindrak. measuring him for the spear. Jindrak tried to move that we've seen him do night after night after night, but this guy was ready for it, guys. Ow! Oh. That is about that. Prelude to the end. He speared him out of his boots is what he did. It's all over but the crying now, guys. Goldberg has dominated this one just like he's dominated every other match in the street. Can it be 34 0? Christy! Throw it down with the jackhammer! The count is now 34 0. But for Goldberg, one of the biggest nights, one of the most important nights for him, comes up in 11 days at WCW since Sunday from the Conceco Fieldhouse in Indianapolis with his friend, his mentor by his side. He'll face two of the toughest in all of WCW, Luger and Buff. Think of this, the man that created Goldberg, Sarge, could be the man that ends his career right. if Sarge comes out on a losing end upcoming at Sin on January the 14th in that tag team match.